All right, welcome back to Game On. And today we're looking at my uh, Nintendo GameCube. This is the one system that I don't have like a lot of games for. Only because, you know, there was like so many other systems out and I almost felt that uh, Nintendo was like, uh, like a kitty system. So um, there is a, like three main reasons why I uh, got this system. So uh, first let's take a look at the GameCube. Okay, this is the front. I love it that it came with like four ports, uh, two memory card slots. Let's look at the side. Vent on this side and a vent on the other side. And here's the back. You know, I always thought one thing was kind of cool about a, a Nintendo GameCube. It's the um, handle that they put on the back of it. I always thought that was cool. It was good for you know, carrying. On top we have the power switch, the reset, and the eject button. Right here, I think I loaned my controllers to one of my buddies. He never did return them, but I do have my Mad Cats controller. Uh, yeah, it did the job. So, why did I end up uh, buying the uh, GameCube? Well, I should show you why. There was one, no, three good reasons. Resident Evil. I was a big Resident Evil fan, and this was the remake. And at the time, you could only get it on the GameCube. Also, Resident Evil Zero. You know, the graphics were really cool. I thought the graphics were, like, nice at the time. And, of course, Resident Evil 4, the all-time great, right here. My other reasons are was uh, I love the multiplayer on uh, 007. Me and my boys used to have lots of fun on this one. It's really cool. And, of course, Gun. It's a good cowboy game. There was, weren't a lot of cowboy games out there, and Gun was a nice one. My last game is Soul Calibur 2. I love the Soul Calibur for a PlayStation, so this was a must. I mean, the graphics were amazing at the time. All right, guys, and that is my small collection of Nintendo GameCube. All right, guys, you have a good day, and remember, game on.